Hello everyone and welcome to the Crypto Session Brief. We're on Friday the 27th of May 2022. Firstly, I must apologize for yesterday's briefing. Uh, it appears there was no sound. Hopefully we are all good today. Not too sure what caused that, just a small technical glitch. Moving on into today's brief, we've got a few things to discuss. Uh, notably, uh, a lot of the red that we've been seeing in these crypto markets over the past few days. If you've been tuning into these briefs, been pretty non-eventful for the past two weeks because we've seen a lot of range trading bit of a pause off the uh, after that recent crash that we saw with the uh, terra coin etc luna uh, exasperated that move to the downside equities also stabilized slightly so again that correlation just holding quite firm and bitcoin and uh, ethereum also holding firm but over the past couple of days just starting to see some more selling creep in and i'll highlight particularly on bitcoin though how we've been able to stabilize so far and haven't uh, come off too bad. As you can see, that big reversal on the H4 bar uh, in the middle of yesterday's session moved down into 28,000. In fact, we were almost touching 28. In fact, we pretty much did touch 28, bounced off it. So then round numbers do play out quite frequently on Bitcoin. Obviously, it's quite uh, tedious to just suggest, okay, well, my next level is 27,000. And you think, well, okay, well, anyone could have got that. But they do play out quite nicely, quite frequently. So that's why I've had that 27 on there for a short while. And you can see almost to the point we reversed off 28,000 yesterday. So then round numbers do play out quite a lot. We've seen that in FX for quite some time. In fact, you see it quite a lot across uh, across markets, especially in the likes of equities where you see psychological handles, etc., etc. And there you go. We've seen a bounce and a bid around that handle. Be aware of a retest so far today. We've been shaping up to the downside. We've been pretty much in the red so far. Uh, and, um, you know, it's just starting to look a little bit heavy here, aren't we? That uh, them range lows really under pressure. And I wouldn't be too surprised to see another retest of 28 before moving down into 27 to test that area. Moving on into Ethereum, and we can see the market is currently at 1778. We can see here it's been able to hold above 1700 just about so far, but looking a little bit more ugly than Bitcoin, I must say. And we can quite clearly see that on evidence of yesterday's daily bar, which got a strong daily close completely below all the previous uh, weekly lows um, and threatening that 1700 handle now unfortunately my chart doesn't have the data going back um, we are just getting that worked on at the moment but uh, if we could go back further than this 1700 handle with your charts you should be able to see this 1700 handle is incredibly significant in fact I'll go as far as to say it's uh, you know, it, it's, it's make or break at 1700 basically. If we can't hold 17, we're set for another leg lower. I've got to move down into 1550 as my next support area. But if we do hold here and if risk sentiment improves slightly, that's the only way we're going to hold here, then it might be a good opportunity to take some short term longs into the 2000 handle. Of course, be aware just below 1700, really important. So a big bounce off there last time off the uh, daily bar today as well you can see that's the low of the day we've come into that so i'll just repeat again 1700 absolutely key litecoin currently at 6305 as you can see here similar to ethereum uh, in the sense that we had a strong daily close below the recent all the recent daily lows yesterday and this market could now be set to test its own recent low down near the 50 cents handle uh, not 50 cents just a 50 handle Overhead, we've got that 75, so basically we're right in the middle, sandwiched in, in between 50 and 75 right now. So it's a case of do we hold this little area here, this little pocket of uh, support at 63, or is it a continuous move to the downside to retest the 50 area on Litecoin? Wrapping up the brief with Ripple, which is currently at 0 0.3870. Um, been able to hold so far, so good. This one is a little bit more like Bitcoin, as you can see. We did test below closed above the support handle of 0 0.3870 if this gives way though and it's looking more and more likely given the pattern that's been shaping up we've got this descending wedge being formed support level at 38.70 if this goes on the daily expect uh, uh, another uh, rather not very pretty weekend uh, i was trying to find the best way to say that but a pretty ugly weekend let's say and a move down into 0 0.3345 is looking more likely if the 0 0.3870 handle does give way just be aware of that looming descending trend line just above us. We've had several higher low, uh, sorry, lower highs now off this trend line. So if we do move back into there, maybe just look for a short opportunity back down into 38.70 handle. That's pretty much it from mine for the crypto brief today. If there's anything else, I'll be inside the X chat room. Until next time, all the best with your trading and bye for now.